Hello, YouTube. It is time. Playoff final against Blackburn. It says that they're going to play a 5-3-2, which is their most successful formation. But I... And then this has them in a 4-3-3. But more recently, they've been playing with a, a diamond midfield. So I am very, very nervous. We are still live on... Twitch, we've got the chat bouncing. We're ready to go. Are we going up to the Premier League? You're about to see what we've done. It is Blackburn versus Derby. Sheffield United are obviously out of the equation as are QPR. A few changes are recommended because we've gone with this side selected. So we've gone with our boys here. Roos, Burn, Bielik, Davies, Buchanan, Bird, Patino, Sibley, Knight, Delap, Lawrence. I've been tossing and turning between bringing Luke Plange as an inside forward. And if I go attacking midfielder right with inside forward, where is it? That's his striker role. Inside forward on attack. Thanks. Thanks, game. Might just be easy if I do it this way, won't it? Inside forward on attack. He does just miss the passing, the technique, the flair. So I'm, I was thinking about bringing him, but I think if we do need it, we're just going to throw. I wish I could just see the the, um, the stats required for the role. If I go attacking midfielder right, let's just do it in here. Inside forward on attack. What is he missing? He, like Dane is more well-rounded in those roles anyway. So even though he's not trained in it, he's actually better. He's got tens and tens as his two lowest stats for the role. So Dane Scarlett's going to be our backup on the right, but I do I would rather him play as the advanced forward as we saw in the last episode. Before we get started, if you are excited for this game, make sure that you smash a thumbs up. Here we go. Derby are uh, at Wembley. Here we go. I'm assuming that Blackburn are going to be set up in their diamond shape, but we're going to see how they're set up in one moment's time. We're in the tunnel. <sighs> what do you attribute your recent good away run to down to hard work? It always helps to be as prolific as our team has been. We haven't really been that prolific lately. This looks nothing like... When they've gone 4 3 3, so they've thrown a curveball at us. They've gone, instead of the diamond, they've gone more traditional with a 4 3 3, which is fine because we've gone with a 4 triple 2. So they're going to have the one extra number in midfield, but we should be able to get the overloads out on the flanks. I am very, very nervous for this game. Here we go. Blackburn kick us off, and here we go. Can we find our way in the Premier League? So far this season, we've played Blackburn twice. We beat them 4-3 the first time, and then we beat them 1-0 the second time. So we are here. It's Chinquino. We know that Blackburn are a very good team in this division. They stick a ball up to the back post. It's Rothwell and Ruzi just settle it down. The nerves would be massively high here for the fans, for the players, for everybody involved at both of these football clubs because they are two prestigious English teams that have been out of the top division for way too long. We haven't started the best. We've had one shot to two, but we know Blackburn are going to be looking to be the more dominant team, which is fine because we've got players, we've got pace, we've got opportunities to hit them on the break. So far, we are going to encourage the boys here just to get them up and about. We are playing a bit of a different shape. Obviously, we played this shape when we came back against Sheffield United. That's a good ball in and it's well blocked there. I'm not sure who that was. That may have been Buchanan or Davies against Bradley Dack. We know he is quality for this league. And we know we've also struggled against corners quite a lot recently as well. So we don't want that to be a reoccurrence here today. But can we get a highlight of our own so that we can start to commentate on things that we're doing in comparison to what Blackburn are doing? That would be fantastic. They have started really strong here. And it's another highlight for Blackburn. There's only going to be so many that we can repel. I'm surprised that these kits have been picked as that shot doesn't go too far wide from the left-hand goalpost. The white kind of clashes with the blue and white. They've got an injury already. Can we press and win this ball? Chinquinho does well, but it's Patino who gets back on the ball. What a ball. Finding Buchanan, the young left back who's had a fantastic season, whips it in towards Liam Delap. 
that would have been massive for us. That would have been absolutely massive if we managed to connect with that one there. I'm going to encourage one more time and see if we can turn some of those dots, faces into green ones. It looks like that chat had no effect except for on the defense, which is quite nice. Two shots, 50% possession now. We're starting to slowly get on the ball. What I'm noticing is their two central midfielders are really aggressive with an AP and a Mazala. So they're obviously going to be looking to bring that ball into our defense, which for me means that we may be able to, on the break, really hit into some good spaces because they should just have their back three or back two with the DM, which it looks like is how they're playing. Dak does seem to drop in a little bit and play almost a bit of a bobby role as an advanced forward, which is a bit weird. But Rothwell, one of those two central midfielders, has run through, and I don't know what he has done there because he rounded Ruse and put that almost out for a throw-in. But Blackburn have started the better team here, but we know that that doesn't matter in particular because we might just need one chance and to put it away. We've only had two shots from our 50% possession, which seems a bit weird considering Blackburn have had 13 from their 53%, but... We've got to half time. No, we haven't. Here we go. Can we maybe steal one on half time? Burn, have a shot. Finds Delap. What a strike. Mm. Liam Delap gets us one new up going into half time. What a finish from the Loney, who will be extending his stay with Derby for another season after this season. Burn, don't know why he's over there. He's playing right back. Finds Delap, and what a volley. That is has to be the goal of the season. How's the timing of the volley and the timing of the moment? We go into halftime, one new up, outstretch the arms. I'm happy with the performance. I am crapping it. Can we somehow do the impossible night? Davies, can we just try and keep the ball? We know that Blackburn now are going to try and press. They're going to have the extra number in midfield Lawrence does well but that's where they're going to pick the ball up good challenge look at the two boys going in together look at them they just double footed him oh here we go don't please don't concede another header I've conceded way too many of these lately it falls to Buckley into Rothwell if they're going to shoot let them shoot from out there if they're going to score a screamer the way we have let them Lennon Ronaldo birdie well done he hasn't played much recently but we've brought him in for the final and I don't know what Knight's doing, but that's kind of concerning. Can we find an easier ball, though? If they're going to press, we should be able to play around it. Oh, my God, these kits are, are really annoying. Here we go. Look at this rotation on the wing here. Knight has Lawrence. I don't know why he sort of just panicked there and just hoofed it, but Kaminsky does pick the ball up, and here come Blackburn. Can we find a way to stop this high line? And it's gone over the bar. Come on, boys. Very end-to-end -end start to this second half. We're only two minutes into the second half and we're on our third highlight. They are pressing like crazy. Lawrence brings the ball down well. Has Sibley running through. Louis Sibley has the lap and we're 2 new up. See! 2-0 to the good. Come on, Darby. Can we do it? That is just pit and hope at that point. Lawrence with a brilliant touch. Finding Sibley, who looked borderline offside. Good ball across. May have taken a deflection. Liam Delap has fired us two new up on the day. Two shots on target. Two goals for Derby. Can we hold on? Come on, boys. Not the statistical game that we were looking for, but can we do it? Can Derby be the team that go up? Oh, this is where I panic now. 56 minutes in, Rothwell. Good ball. Can we win? Knight needs to do better. They've turned us inside out, and that is over the bar. Come on, boys. Can we now pick them apart? They've gone back into their diamond, which is interesting to note. I'm thinking of taking Burn off very soon for Ebiselli because we know Ebiselli, number one, has had a fantastic year. Number two, I'm a bit scared of the yellow card. I don't want an incident happening. Well done, Charlie Patino, who is coming back, I think, for another... Uh, we have to check if he's coming back for another season or not. Sibley finds Burn. We've got an option there. We don't use it. Burn whips it. Delap. Oh. All right, we're going to get Ebiselli on. We're making our first change because I'm worried. One, about the legs, and two, about the yellow card. Here we go. Can we get the job done? This would be against all odds. This would be a huge upset if we could find a way to get out of this game. Blackburn are going to throw everything at us. It is Bradley Dak. We just can't give him an easy one. Back, and it's over the bar. Come on, Derby. The fans are going mental in the stands. 
can we find a way to just keep this advantage even if it's for another 15 minutes Davies has no legs that doesn't matter he's our captain he stays on the lap just do something without just running the ball out you moron Oh, just set up shape Knight is struggling and what I'm thinking of doing is it might be Dane Scarlet time on the break Knight what's just going on there what's just going on no what did he do what did Knight do did he just slice him in half okay this is concerning he, we've just got a red card can I see the highlight again alright Sibley's going to drop in as the attacking midfielder on support. Oh, I don't like this. All right. That's all fine. That's all fine. Yeah, I like that shout, Dim. DLP on defend. Ball winner can stay on support. We can, I'm going to keep the wing backs on. I don't want to shut up shot yet because there's still so much time. We're not going to look for the overlaps, but I still want to try and... So we're just going to let them dictate it. I'm going to take all the instructions off. Play for set pieces. Perfect. Dribble less. Be more disciplined. We're going to start time wasting. Winding down the clock. The tempo will go standard. Shorter passing. We can counter press when we've lost the ball because I think we just need to try and win it back as much as possible. And we'll hold shape when we win it back. That's all fine and dandy. Oh my God, that just scared the crap out of me. Thank you for the follow as we're in the most <laughs> the most important part of our season that we need to make these decisions and get them right. Davies is really struggling. Focus play wide kills your wingers, by the way. But we don't as in the wing backs, that's fine. I can we don't have wingers anymore, so that that's fine. Um do we keep two up front? That's the question. Do we take a striker off or a defensive midfielder and go more into Nah, because then you got no outlet ball. Um, uh, I don't know what to do here, guys. I really don't. Um, Bird's still really fit. Patino. I didn't bring a left back. I didn't think we we're going to need to change that at all. All right, let's just let it go for five. Let's just see how it goes. Let's see how this goes. They've got plenty of guys on cards as well, so they may potentially get themselves into some card trouble trying to press us. Patino. Looking for Lawrence. Oh, God, come on. Just don't... Well done, Bielik. Good boy. We just need to try and burn the next eight minutes or so, I think. Oh, we've got nothing to play to. There we go, and we're out. Oh, no, we're not, because we came back into danger. Sibley, just got to find something here. There we go. Lawrence, on your bike, man. Come on. I don't like where this is going. Sibyls, the lap. I really don't like where this is going. I really don't like where this is going. I really don't like where that's going. Oh, we've got nothing to play to. I almost want to just go 4-4-1. I want to go 4-4-1, guys, so we've got wingers. Yeah. I just We need players. We need just guys here just to be able to move the ball in the channels, play with like a deep line forward. What do you guys think? What do you guys reckon? We need we need width. We're going to need width to be able to play out of this. I don't think with 10 we're going to be able to do it. Oh, Sibley and Patino are both gassed, are they? Oh, we can't play narrow because they're just going to... They are just going to... Oh, man. I've got no one that can play these roles, man. All right, Lawrence. The laps is going to have to do a job up front. Sibley off. Oh, man, 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 man. Because I could have used Ebiselli at right back. Got right mid, sorry. <sighs> Stearman. All right, we might have to put Stearman at, at fullback. How about we do this? What do you guys think of this? And then just go wingers on support. What do you guys think of that? I 
I really don't know what to do. What do you guys think of that? And just try and play our way up to the lap. Oh, I got one more sub, do we? And then we go Dane. Can the lap play right side? We can play left. Oh, ball winning on defend. Yeah, I like that. So just keep two in front and then double winger on attack and just run at them. All right. I wouldn't mind keeping one more sub and we just play like that, I think. All right, let's go. Come on. What are the chances of getting a bloody red card in this game? <sighs> YouTube, I'm sorry. This might not be my most entertaining episode, but you're just seeing my thought process. Ebersells does well. Come on, Delap. You're just going to have to run and do a shift here. Can we win this ball? Well done. Ebiselli, please go. Use that pace, Ebiselli. Burn him. Whip a ball in. Delap's there. Oh. That would have been the one. Can we jag one goal on the break? One more goal on the break. Do we leave Delap on or do we take Pat Charlie Patino? I think Patino is the one that has to come off. We need Patino off. I think we need legs in the midfield. I think we bring on... We bring White on here, I think. As a DLP on defend, we bring White on to see us out here. That's what we're going to do. Can we... Can we... Actually, oh, I was going to say, do we start Ebiselli a bit higher and go off-center, but I don't think we do. All right, we're going cautious. Come on. No more highlights. Please, no more highlights. 90th minute approaching. Please. Because we've got nothing left. Oh, no. No. Just hoof it. Just hoof it. Oh, no. Not this one here, wide. Oh, come on. Come on, just tick, 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 tick. Please, just keep ticking. Just keep ticking. Oh, no. Come on. Just put it in the stands. <laughs> Come on. Season. Come on, lads. We're there. Season one, we are in the Premier League with Derby. Oh, my God. Who would have thought? What have we experienced? What the hell have we experienced on this bloody stream? That is just next level. We've won the most prestigious game of football. The 80 million bloody dollar game, whatever it is. Oh my God, YouTube. What an episode that is for you guys. Derby win the playoff from fifth. Who would have thought? If you've enjoyed this episode, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. We will see you uh, very, very soon. We get 26 million for next season and a big wage budget. We will update you on what happens. Look at that timing for the socials to come up on the screen as well. Der Derby board praise unbelievable promotion. Derby board have declared that gaining promotion is a quite unbelievable achievement given this skepticism surrounding the club's chances of promotion when the season began. We've done a remarkable job at Pride Park and we were predicted 24th at the start of the year. We finished fifth and we have managed to get our way into the Premier League. You're going to see us very, very soon for another episode of our Road to Glory here with Derby and let's get into the Premier League.